Well guys, the version 15.0 update has just been added to the Fortnite files, meaning that season 5 is just around the corner. But first, yes, we have indeed got to have our one and only live event in which Galactus is apparently going to be speaking. We've got our first season 5 teasers, apparently that is leaked, and just a bunch more stuff guys. Yo guys, what is going on? Bubbles here. Yes, that's right. Today I am in fact here to bring you guys all of the latest Fortnite news leaks and updates. So if you guys go on to enjoy today's video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button, as well as obviously subscribing to me here on the channel to stay up to date with absolutely everything Fortnite news related. And finally guys, credit code bobbles in the Fortnite item shop to help put your gal that one step further. Let's get into it today though. What have we got? Topic number one, let's talk about the house party wrap. This is in fact a sort of new feature. It was introduced a few months back, but it's fully in the game now in the sense that you can chat with friends while in a Fortnite game and you can actually see their cameras on in the corners, which is honestly a really nice feature that they've got. So first of all, I'll play a trailer for you guys to enjoy, but let's talk about it. What is this? Well, basically it's only actually on PC and PlayStation at the moment, PlayStation 4 and 5 that is. So unfortunately Xbox can't do this, but if you actually activate this and log in and connect your accounts, then you can actually get a free Rainbow Fog wrap, which honestly looks pretty damn decent. However, if you are on Xbox and you can't get this, there is another way to get this wrap and it's simply by playing five matches with friends between the time period of the 20th to the 26th of November and you'll receive it by December 4th. So that's honestly awesome and a great free wrap. Next up though guys, what have we got? The Powerhouse Pack. It's a brand new pack that is a Save the World exclusive pack. It's just been added. I think these are monthly things. Maybe every two months we get these brand new Powerhouse Packs on Save the World. $16 and it is in fact included with a skin, a back bling, Save the World items as well as then the one and only V-Bucks. The real reason why people want to get this pack as well as obviously the exclusive skin. But yeah, honestly a really nice little pack and if you've got Save the World, I recommend getting it. Or if you want to get Save the World, if you buy this pack, it actually comes with Save the World. So that's pretty decent. Next up though, a feature that's actually in Brazil at the moment, and hopefully it will get rolled out throughout the rest of the world soon, is in fact a new Reboot A Friend. Brazil are having all of these kind of exclusive community goal challenge things going on, and they've got this new Reboot A Friend feature, which is honestly pretty decent. And basically all you've got to do is connect your accounts and link them with friends and that kind of thing and you get these amazing free rewards. There's four free rewards at the moment and just again I hope that this comes to the rest of the world very soon because I also would like to get these free rewards. Next up here creators. They are in fact getting these brand new sort of comic book looks that uh, Epic have literally made and have been sending them out which honestly is incredible. Now no obviously this doesn't mean they're going to get their own exclusive Fortnite skin but a lot of creators are getting this comic book style of them which I just think is incredible. Benji Fishy got one, Ali has got one and a bunch more but those two were my favourite and they honestly look incredible and I think this is because they're making them into one of the Fortnite comics I do believe and that's why they're sending them out to kind of get permission I guess to use them. I don't know it looks awesome though really nice feature and I want you guys to let me know if you've seen any of these which one's your favorite but next up here guys we're gonna get into all of the good stuff all of the event stuff the season five stuff it's honestly incredible and a lot of it is actually blowing my mind so like I said earlier version 15.0 that is indeed the big season five update meaning that it's been fully added into the files of the game and it basically is sitting waiting to then get actually published on the day of the new season but it also means that every Everything is ready, everything is set. There is honestly some huge files that apparently have been founding it. Files that are way bigger than any other seasons. So hopefully we're getting some really awesome stuff. And honestly, I'm just really excited about this new season. So while we're talking of season five, let's talk about first of all, the actual leaked sort of teaser, if you want to call it a teaser image that's going around. It is in fact this image here. Now, I have a few things to say about this image. First of all, yes, it looks awesome, and yes, I would love for it to be real. However, the only thing is, is that there's actually two different versions of it going round. One of them is this one, which actually then has all of the kind of countdown on it and more things on it, which is honestly just making me believe that it's not real. The reason why I say that is, is it too good to be true? Also in this image, it looks sort of like there's the whole black hole thing going on, which obviously over the past few days, and I'll say I've been doing 
as well. There's been a lot of hype and build up leading up to make us believe that there's going to be like a black hole 2.0 in Fortnite. And again, yes, I think it would be awesome, but will it happen? I, I can't tell you that. I honestly don't think it will. And even if it does, is this image kind of just giving it away too much? I think personally it could be. This image is kind of the image that we will see when we log on to Fortnite and we'll be in this black hole and there'll be the countdown leading us to season five. I don't know. I don't think it's real. Last time we were in a black hole, we never had a countdown. It was just, it randomly come up one day. So I don't think that this is accurate personally. Again though, I could be completely wrong. It could be legit, but I just don't think so. Let me know what you guys think though. One of the reasons why I don't think it is real also is in matter of fact that the actual AES key was actually found meaning that the AES is basically a key in which you use to basically find out everything in the file and the key for the version 15.0 was actually found by two leakers and Vast Blast was in fact one of them a very reliable source for Fortnite news that I use and he basically stated that they are not going to be leaking anything with this key anything in the files so thank you to them because it would have everything to do with the event in it and that kind of stuff so thankfully it's not and i feel like in the event if we was to get this sort of black hole with that loading screen it would actually be them that would have leaked it and no one else has access to the key meaning that no one else would have access to that image which again backs up my point of I think it's fake. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Do you think the teaser's real? Do you think it's fake? All that kind of stuff in the comments below. But we're gonna move on to a little theory of mine. And if we actually look back a chapter ago exactly, we actually had the trailer, which I'm gonna play in the background of the video now, which was obviously the Worlds Collide trailer. Worlds Collide was indeed the season five, chapter one trailer, and it was the theme of the whole season. Worlds Collide because there there was all the rifts going on leading all things to actually start connecting from what we thought was the real world to then the Fortnite world, which makes sense. However, Worlds Collide, could that also be leaking then to this upcoming season that we're going to get of the Chapter 2 Season 5 of the Worlds Colliding? I mean, we're seeing rifts in Fortnite yet again, just randomly appear, and a lot of them at that. We're also kind of going through a phase in which Galactus is coming to kind of destroy worlds, you know, the devourer of worlds, and maybe the worlds are somehow going to connect from the two seasons seasons because even Donald Mustard himself, the creative director of Fortnite, stated that you're not going to believe the things and how long Fortnite have actually been planning ahead of the seasons. So it could honestly be accurate in the sense that the two Fortnite worlds are going to somehow collide. Meaning maybe next season, season five, where the worlds collide, we might potentially see some of the old Fortnite POIs return maybe on the new Fortnite map. It's just a theory of mine. Again, let me know what you guys think about that. I haven't seen anyone talk about it, but I think it should be spoken about because I think it is quite a potential theory. And the final thing now that I actually want to talk about is just briefly about the event. I'm not going to leak anything whatsoever about the event. I'm trying to avoid all spoilers myself for it. Again, hopefully it's not going to be leaked because the AES key is literally only between two people at the moment. Hopefully it stays that way. The event, something we do know is actually that the actual Galactus is going to have some form of voiceover in the event. We know that because IMDB has actually given credit to Gino Sagers. I hope I've said that right. Meaning that he has been some form of voiceover. Whether or not it's just going to be like grunts, or like shouting or speaking that's maybe in like a foreign language or something i don't know but hopefully he does say something and it's gonna be creepy i don't know apparently he's got a deep voice this guy i don't know myself but something exciting to look forward to at least anyway for the event but guys that is indeed gonna be it for today's video i hope you guys have indeed enjoyed if you have obviously smash that thumbs up button obviously subscribe to me here on the channel to stay up to date with everything fortnite related and finally guys create a code bubbles in the fortnite item shop to help put your gal that one step further hashtag ad hashtag epic partner thank you all in advance i hope you all have an amazing rest of your day and until next time guys see ya